welcome back to Ed Effect. Episode 3 is what this video is, and I'm going to be going on next on to. I don't know, this is a quick upgrade. Uh, yes, do some damage. Yeah, so now we're going to continue. I'm going to spend some money to the next mission, which is the fourth episode. Wait, yeah, this is no, this is not episode 3, this is episode 4. My bad. Medical treatment has finished. Analysis of your state of health. Blood pressure, 120 over 80. Temperature, 36 degrees Celsius. Stable state. Welcome back. Yes. The treatment is accompanied by side effects. Part of them is the ability to slow down the time. Alright. So we got some uh, fear movement speeds. It's working. This is called the bullet time. We developed it as part of the dead effect project. A side effect of the zombie virus. That's perverse. What else? Alright. Sir, we have reached a breaking through a breakthrough in the uh, augmentation of short-term increase of reaction speed out of our test subject, which shows visible faster re reflexes and movement speed after we have applied the DE. 20, 2000, uh, 247C. It also, also, our pressure to report that unlike strains A and B, there are no permanent side effects this time. We are inherent. Initially, in the second phase of testing, we, and we will need more time. Uh, subjects. Okay. One out of fourteen. Holy smokes! So let's search around this room real quick for that. Switched up their uh, load out of it, so now I got a, a revolver. Got to mention that I think. Money. Okay. Nothing I have to shoot yet. when it said one or two I think ah here we go next one I've installed security locks on the entry gate to the cargo bay according to order sir 12 that's the entrance to the cargo bay has been closed enter the access code I cannot open the entrance to the cargo bay remotely enter the data fields I am opening the corridor Get all the stuff in one go. And so far, I think the story's okay. Uh, I haven't played the sequel yet, but you guys do know we have the sequel. Uh, I don't know. I think I'll play it after this, basically. Warning: Cargo Bay Integrity 
disrupted, access connection, blah, 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 deactivated. All right, all crew, encrypted message, Joe Hayes here. I've managed to find some of the info into the system. DE-250 has been applied to a subject in the detox center. I don't have any details, but I am worried that it might be you, Davis. I've also hacked the logs, and according to those 117 test subjects died, 239 are in the com uh, are in a coma, and 422 suffered permanent damage after that. It's been tested on them. It's all really weird. There's not even that many people aboard the ship. crew of the e of the ESS Meridian there have been many inquiries about the health of the captain Philip Professor Wagner who is responsible for his treatment has set visiting hours during which anyone will be able to visit him all those who would like to see the captain should report to the zero labs however you will only be allowed to visit one at a time so that he isn't subjugated to too much stress <laughs> If you guys don't know, there is an achievement for uh, the stun gun. I have to get 500 stun gun kills in order to get the achievement. So, that's why I keep using the stun gun a lot. Also, it's pretty fun to use. Uh, there it is. Okay, two out of five to destroy. Okay. Spray man, half the spray. Sixty rounds. So we are still working to make Subject Razor less vulnerable to radiation poisoning. Subject Razor to the radiation in the pollution core turned out to be a failure. So we have decided to try a new approach, the method of cell multiplication. This method has a known side effect which causes a 3% increase of body mass. If you give your consent to the use of this method, we will begin creating new clones of Subject Razor in order to begin testing access denied exit door lock
Most of the crew in the colonists are sleeping in the habitation pods and awaiting the end of the long flight. The only ones awake are the necessary crew and the maintenance team. Our pilots lead by lead by first mate Gene S. Dip, Duper, Duper. Mechanics under the supervisor Mitchell Steele, Cargo Bay, personnel overseer by Donald Flander. Other scientists team led by Professor Heinrich Wagner. <laughs> 6 out 14. destination is the planet Tau uh, to Kalfi F I can't say that right which has been de deemed inhabitable for by long distance scans just a few years ago such a journey would take thousands of years now thanks to the FTL motor technology it should take a mere 12 years 4 months and 17 days if everyone go everything goes according to plan the propulsion cores uses nuclear Proportion and is capable is able to function self sufficiently for 20 years. So it's a one year trip. opened so what do you guys think of the game so far um i know this is like the ep fourth episode uh, i personally think the game's kind of cool uh especially when i got it for like 90 cents so can't really scream or cry about that yeah i was looking for that orb okay Get this one first in the year 2044 after the success of the mars one expedition that started the colonization of Mars, new colonists were sent beyond the galaxy, new Noah's Ark was constructed to hold specimens of the flora and fungi of all biomes. I, James Philip, have been named captain of the ESS Meridian, the ship that will carry us towards a new life. Okay. Time to shake this cage. Time to shake the shade. Warning, unpermitted activity in the propulsion core gates closing. What's this? Oh, haze here. There is ton oh, haze here. There is bit tons of zombies in the data fields. According to the sensors, I, it's like a New Year, Year's party here. There. What the hell are they all doing there? Nobody should be allowed access, so how did they get in? Davis. If you're reading this, be careful. I'm gonna hit this one first. Okay. 
Access code string. It is not the whole thing yet. Continue in your search. There is yet a more serious problem. There could be something even worse. As the pilots are absent, the return program has has activated. Perfect. Let's go home. The craft is contaminated with the virus. It is a biological bomb aiming straight at the Earth. Oh shit. Can't see the code now. Final part. I got the rest of the access code string. Excellent. Now get back to the gate. Elsewhere. It is contaminated with the undead. The control room is blocked. Fuck the undead. I'm section 15, the elite unit. The only way is to block the propulsion right in the propulsion core. Let's grab this. The scientist team lead by Professor Wagner and Dr. Belinky is working tirelessly and experimenting with the most effective use of the human resources. The basis of their research is a cloning unit which would be capable of creating duplicates of any and all organic materials. The system isn't without flaws but the science team has enough time to perfect it. 10 found. Access denied. Exit door locked. I've been through here before. I haven't. Team's research has researched a major breakthrough thanks to the newly discovered dead effect. Dead <laughs> organisms organisms can be kept in a state of prepultural low energy and high performance activity. The science team is currently working on its further enhancements that could help colonize Tau Tau C O V F. <laughs> Thank you. 
are several greenhouses on board the ESS Meridian containing the flora and flora of all natural earth habitants. The greenhouses are constructed to keep a steady environment for the flora. Fauna and flora they contain, they are self subsided and will get you because of Well, sorry guys, at the end there. This is actually a long episode. Yeah, I have. Okay. All the orbs. Now, my defense system ensures the safety of the ship and its crew. The scientists, the security holes, defense units may be awakened from the habitation at any time in case of potential danger. The Admiral has also requested the presence of Unit 13 at the last moment. They are all elite war veterans and according to their records, a proper killing machines. Most of them are in habitation, hi oh, hibernation, my bad, not habitation, Ugh. excluding uh, Joaquin Hayes and Frank Colist Colicta. Okay, one more to find. I think it's going to be in here. Or hold on. part of the game. Dude, 
I'm missing one. where this last uh, thing is before I get out of here. So um, I'll be back when I find it. Okay, so I've been searching a while for this thing and I finally found it. Um, yeah, I had somehow walked over it because I guess it's super tiny, that's why. It blends in with the background, so I kind of just missed it. It's right here. Warning, cargo, and blah, 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 and drop decks, okay. Uh, it's, it's here. It looks like where I reach we're headed towards the terminals with the access codes to cargo bay gates. I can't connect to them. They're probably not a part of the original cargo bay equipment. It's like they don't belong there at all. All right, that's 14 out of 14. Now I'm going back to the starting room. So it was this way. It was behind you when you enter. So it was right behind. So we got everything now. So let's get out of here. So as usual, like and subscribe. And I hope to see you guys in the next one.